Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, heading to the beach tomorrow, sunscreen a must. A lot of sunshine coming up for tomorrow. Beautiful day. In fact, even right now, uh, it's very nice. Skies have cleared out after kind of a gray, damp start early this morning. These are live pictures down in Newport now looking at uh, Newport Harbor with uh, clear weather. Uh, humidity will be dropping off. Uh, dew points are still somewhat high, but drier air working in courtesy of a northwest breeze. So it's going to set the stage for comfortable weather this evening, overnight, and especially through tomorrow. Threat tracker now through tomorrow and Thursday. Low level green. Really don't see anything significant as far as showers, storms, or severe weather. You can see that clearing trend on the satellite photo all across southern New England right now. We widen out the view and some of the clouds and damp weather from at least the first half of the day is now offshore. You see all the clear conditions across New England. As we widen out the view, we see high pressure, fair weather system right in here. Uh, it's in control and it's really keeping things clear from the Midwest all the way up into New England. So all of this real estate of clear weather belongs to us. Notice thunderstorms. I have the lightning tracker turned on up through uh, the Great Lakes, now through the Northern Plains. Storms staying away. So we're in the right spot for the next a couple of days, even through Friday, for some pretty decent weather. I mean, temperatures are not that bad. We really don't see any signs of, uh, you know, big heat or heat waves building. So the pattern uh, really favors temperatures to be either at or slightly uh, above normal, but as far as excessive warmth, uh, not in the cards here. Getting real close, take a look at Futurecast. Any attempts for this evening and through the overnight, you see them settling back into the upper 50s to around 60. This is 7 o'clock in the morning, waking up to sunshine, and it's all day sunshine tomorrow, unlike today. By 2 o'clock in the afternoon, notice areas away from the coastline are, are in the lower 80s, around 82, 83. Beaches in the south shore with a sea breeze, mid 70s, gorgeous then tomorrow evening at 6 o'clock, sunshine 82, and by 9 o'clock tomorrow evening, clear skies and pleasant dry with a temperature at 72. I mean, if I had to give this a letter grade, it's easily A+. Plus. So Mother Nature doing her homework here. All right, tomorrow morning, sunny, dry. Sunrise temperatures in the 60s, but a rapid warm-up during the afternoon in the uh, lower 80s. So not just nice, ultra nice. Great at the beach, too. Water temp at 70. Safe sun time coming in at 15 minutes. Uh, future cast, as far as the shower coverage next several days, it is practically nothing here through Friday. We'll inch it up into at least the isolated category on Saturday, but looking at the weekend future cast, at this point, I wouldn't call either Saturday or Sunday uh, rain days or stormy, but rather the chance for a couple of showers both of those days. Temperatures slightly cooler over the weekend. You know, upper 70s. The average high is about 80 so we're close, but looking good tomorrow as well as Thursday, Friday, a cloud sun mixture, more humid with a high temperature coming in at around 80 degrees. So uh, pretty nice the next several days. This doesn't seem like August. We were talking about that before. Well, I mean, I, it was when we were kids, it always seemed like it was hot, just hot, hot and humid. <laughs> uh, seasonable temperatures, but the long range forecast in the end of the month doesn't really foresee any big heat building. All right. Tomorrow's beautiful. Though. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Tony.